Are you ready for another new face? What's up, socials? Happy Sexy Wednesday. Today we have a guest contributor on the vlog. It's Owen Hemsath from the Video Spot channel, and he is going to tell us how to make our websites a little bit more sexy by helping them be found in search. Stay tuned, a ton of information you can implement right away, so I hope you do that, and make sure you stay to the end and come back and hang out with me for a minute. Thanks, Amy. Hi, everyone. I'm so excited to be here. My name is Owen. I'm the president of a company called Video Spot Studios out here in San Diego, California. What we do is we produce and market videos for our clients. And so SEO is a big, big, big part about what we do because we want to make sure that all of our clients' videos and all the websites that we build for our clients make it to the top of Google. And so today what I'm going to show you how to do is how to make a sexier website focusing on probably the sexiest part of SEO, a thing that we call PageRank. Now what PageRank is, is a numeric value that Google assigns to every single page in your website on a scale from zero to 10. 10 being like your MSNs, uh, your Google, your Huffington Post, and then zero being the website that you just started yesterday. Now your PageRank is based on the amount of sites that are linking back to you saying, oh my gosh, there's relevant content here. You should look at this. So our goal is to build a website with a structure in it where you're actually building page rank internally and driving traffic to your site that way. We call this a silo structure. We want to silo all the content in your website into theme or keyword based categories. We call these silos. And if you want to rank for a given keyword, you need to create a silo of that keyword in your website. So let's take a look at what a basic website you know, might look like. Here you've got your homepage. And on your homepage, typically you'll have like your logo up here, right? And then you'll have kind of like your main navigation stuff right up here. Well, each of these main navigation bars should be keyword based and these are where your silos are actually going to live. So when you click on this page, what you're doing is actually going to the first or the top page in your silo. Let's bring that way down here. So your top silo is up here and this is really the page that you're trying to rank. For our example, we're going to use the term peanut butter. So let's say that you're trying to rank for the term peanut butter. What you're going to do is you're going to create a content rich page that uses the keyword peanut butter. You're going to want to use that keyword term one to 3% of the time, and you're going to want to include at least one outbound link to a third party site that is about peanut butter. And then you're going to want to create six sub pages underneath that site that are all linked to in this main page. So on this main page, you're going to be linking to six sub pages that each have something to do about a subtopic of peanut butter. So for example, if you're trying to rank for the keyword peanut butter, you might create some sub silo pages that are, you know, slash chunky, slash smooth, slash organic, slash get stuck in your teeth and here's how you floss them out. I don't know. You come up with the different subtopics that are all relevant to your main keyword. In these sub silo pages, you're going to want to make sure that you have a link that goes back to the main silo page. And what you're doing here is you're passing page rank on to this main page and making it more valuable to Google. Now, you're going to do that across all 10, 15, 20, 25 of your keywords, however many keywords you're trying to rank this site for. How do you start? Find the keyword, pick the subtopics, and start writing. You need to have at least a minimum of 400 words per page. You want to make sure that each page has at least two images that have alt text in that image also related to the topic of your keyword. Now the next thing that you're going to want to do is start writing a series of blogs. So you might write on organic peanut butter, you might write three blogs about a different topic related to organic peanut butter and you're going to link to this one sub silo page. Then maybe you'll write three more blogs and link to the smooth peanut butter page. And what you're doing now here is you're passing page rank onto your sub silo pages, making them more valuable, which then makes your top silo more valuable, which then makes your home page more valuable and gets you ranked on the web. So how do you build page rank for your blogs? Social media. 
posting on Twitter, posting on Facebook, posting on Pinterest. And for more great information on how to do that, you gotta tune into Savvy Sexy Social every single week to listen to Amy's tips for getting your blog posts out there on social media. But if you're looking to build your page rank and you wanna do it effectively and long term, the silo structure is the most stable and productive way of building a website using relevant content that your audience is looking for. I hope you enjoyed this tip. And if you're looking for more incredible ways Ways to rank your website, build videos, and do all that kind of great stuff, please check out our channel and give us a subscribe there. Amy, thank you so much. Back to you. That's all for today's socials. Thank you so much for tuning in. I appreciate it as always. And thanks to Owen for the awesome information. Make sure you go to his channel, subscribe, check out all the great stuff he's got going on. He's got a lot of great info about YouTube and videos and SEO and all that fun stuff. So definitely check that out. And I hope you'll also check out the link in the description for a free live webinar I'll be doing next week with my top seven tips to becoming a pro vlogger. I'd love to see you there. I'm gonna have a couple different dates and times so we can accommodate people in different cities and countries. So I hope you can make it. And I, of course, will see you tomorrow for Social Thursday.